Tonight, out on Chatfield Reservoir, first responders rescued a total of eight people and mm -hmm. two dogs from the water. South Metro Fire says strong winds created a dangerous situation out there tonight. Rhea Ja joins us live just to kind of catch us up on the conditions out there and what happened, Rhea. Jennifer and Kyle, the winds are strong. You can see my hair just kind of blowing all over the place. But we just spoke with Colorado Parks and Wildlife, who cleared up some information for us. So South Metro Fire responded to two calls tonight. The first one was around 730, where four paddle boarders were out on the water. They got stuck in some trees due to the high winds. South Metro Fire ended up going and rescuing them. Then a second call came with two more paddle boarders and their two dogs. So then another boat comes in with two more people. They they tried to save the two paddle boarders. That boat ends up capsizing. South Metro Fire ended up having to deploy two ranger boats because the first ranger boat they sent out ended up also getting some water in the boat. So six paddle boarders, two dogs and two people on a boat and CPW says none of them were wearing life jackets. That's really something that we're, we're shocked to see, especially with the weather being what it is, with the wind gusts that we're experiencing, and really just the high number of water recreational deaths we've had so far this year. Thankfully, everyone is okay. No injuries were reported, but CPW is asking anyone that's thinking about going out on the water in the future to just look out for those severe weather warnings that were out tonight, and please wear a life jacket if you are thinking about it. Reporting live at Chatfield State Park, Ria Cha, 9 News.